At start of the film, 1989 Paris is shown. We see a boy at an underground place. It was quite dark at this place, and a boy was painting on the wall of a tunnel. Along with that, he was listening to songs, but then suddenly he heard a loud voice. When the boy turned on the light and looked that way, someone was coming towards him in the dark. And now the boy who came close to the boy, he was very scared to see him. He started running to save his life. He saw a small cave there, in which he goes and tries to save his life. But then that thing grabs him from behind, pulls him out and kills him mercilessly. And we could only hear the screams of that boy. After this, the scene changes and we see the time of 1992. And once again, we are shown Paris. Here, we see three friends at once. One of them was a girl, Sonia, and she had two friends. One friend's name is Max. These three are talking to each other that our studies are over. So why don't we go somewhere? Somewhere that is different from everyone else, where no one has ever been. And we go and explore that place and record everything and find out what is there and how it is. They were talking about this when a boy named Remy came here, who was actually a track dealer. He comes to the bar and goes straight to the bathroom. Then Sonia also follows him because he is also their friend. They start talking to each other and Sonia takes two packets of drugs from him. Then the two of them start talking about tomorrow's party, after which Sonia and her two friends leave to go home, because the three of them had no one but each other. It was the family of these three. But we see that two men are following them, who are watching them from the bar. But in this way, unknowingly, they come home and sleep. Then Sonia sees that they have entered their house, and one man starts hitting them, while the other kills Sonia. But then Sonia suddenly wakes up. She got very scared. But thinking this, she is satisfied that thank God, it was a dream and she goes to sleep again. Now the next day, the three friends get well prepared and leave with full preparation because they were going somewhere according to their plan to explore it. And Max is recording everything in his camera. After walking a little distance, they see Remy, who was also going with them. And these people move forward. Remy tells them that there is a metro station next to which there is a tunnel. There is an underground place below it, where there are many tunnels and caves. So we will go there to explore, after which these people move forward and pass through a tunnel. Here Max asks Remy that the underground place where we are going, is it safe? Is there any danger there? And is there a light to see that place or not? Remy says, man, that place is good, where you will feel completely free, and you will feel very good. After passing through this tunnel, they reached a place where there was a small cave in front. Remy tells everyone to go inside the cave, and these people pass through the cave one by one and finally come to that underground place. They also took flashlights with them, because it was very dark here. As they move forward, they see a lot of smoke at one place. Along with that, there were already some other people here, and as soon as these four came to that place, they told them to hold their hands up. They threatened them by saying that we are policemen. Now because it is dark, they cannot see them, but then they come in front of them. And it turns out that these people are Remy's friends who are choking with them. Now, these people sit together at one place and start partying here. Remy talks to his friend about going to the famous place here, the White Zone. After hearing the name of the White Zone, Sonia asks Remy where that place is. How is it? Tell me its details. Only Remy says that it is the best place here. But very few people go there. Big, big, frowning things have been made about that place. Sonia's friend starts talking to Remy's female friend here. That girl tells her that I have come here only because my brother is lost here. I have come to find him. I have no doubt about coming to a place like this. Then Sonny's friend also tells her about herself that even I don't live with my M.O.M. and dad. And my family, Sonia and Maxi. Now, Sonia was happy to see them talking and started making videos of them. After which these were people leave to explore the next place. Now, Remy had a map with which they were moving forward. Looking at the map. Remy tells them that we are under the biggest buildings of Paris. Now, when these people moved forward, they started hearing voices of some people. After hearing this, they become quiet. One of the people whose voices were heard comes out and starts toilet there. Seeing this, the four of them felt very bad, and they push that man and run away. But they started chasing these four, and finally, they are caught. This was a gang of gangsters. The people who were very dangerous, they started to behave very badly with these four people. Their head comes near Sonia, grabs her hair and starts hitting her. Then they leave Sonia and come near the three and start hitting them. But Sonia takes a gun and taunts them. She then shoots the head on the air, which makes all the people very nervous. At one point, Sonia then takes her friends and runs ahead from here. With this, the four of them were very scared. The problem was that they had lost their way here badly. So they start looking for a way out. 
These people reach a place where there was a lot of water. There were a lot of rats here too. Seeing this, they felt very strange. But when they came to the other side, they came to a new place. There were a lot of iron handles on the wall here, which I used to climb up. Now as Rumi grabs one handle, it separates from the wall. That means it can't get out of this place. As they move forward, they see a man who is Remy's friend. Remy asks him the way out. Then he shows them a place like a tunnel, in which they go in turn and come to the other side. There were some people here too. The darkness was also very much, so they started moving forward with their flashlights on. But then Sonny's friend's foot gets stuck in a round wheel, which was actually a trap. That means someone was set up to catch it. If it gets stuck in it, it gets hurt a lot and it starts screaming in pain. These people somehow get her foot out of the trap. Then Remy's fuel friend comes here and steals the bag from her and moves forward. Although Remy was stopping her from going alone, but she didn't stop. They saw a small place. They think this is definitely the way out. That's why they put Sonia's injured friend inside it and start moving to the other side. But then suddenly the place breaks and these people take it out. And Sonia's friend is left with hair. Now, these people have to find Rima's fuel friend. They reach a place where another trap was set up. They see the wire of which. So they don't move forward, they stop. But then, they started hearing loud growling sounds from behind them. That's why they move forward without touching the wire. But whatever was behind them, their voices were getting louder. At the end, Max was left, who was recording the video of all these things. And that thing finally comes here, which was actually a wolf wolf. Max sees it through the camera, but the rest of the people can't see it. And now, Max has also reached them, and these people move forward from that tunnel. Everyone tells Max to show us the video that you recorded, so that we can see what was behind us, whose voice was so loud. But Max was so scared of that wolf that he lied to him, that I didn't make any video. In a state of panic, he started smoking a cigarette, while the rest of the three keep talking to each other looking at the map. That's when Max's eyes go to a nameplate on the wall. He gets very scared and tells the three, Do you know where we are at this time? We are in the white area, that is, in the white zone. They find out that this place is a bunker made by the Germans. In World War II, they used to hide in this underground place. So these people are happy that there must be a way out of here. Now, Max went ahead to find a way out. And these people follow him. She came to a room where she goes inside and turns on the lights. Actually, the stuff of World War II was still lying here which was exactly the same. And she starts checking everything here. That's when she felt the urge to come to someone. When she checks, she goes crazy. Because there was Remy's friend who was in a very bad condition. Because one of his hands was cut and the face was covered in blood. And he was completely injured. It looked like someone had attacked him mercilessly, which is obviously nothing else. But he was a wolf. She was crying, asking for help. But now suddenly the wolf comes again and attacks him. He slaps him completely. Seeing this, Max immediately closes the door, and these people can only hear his screams outside. That is, the wolf tore him apart and killed him. Because of this, all four of them get very scared. They were also very worried. Sitting in one place, they start thinking what to do next. After all, how to get out of this place. Now, after checking all the stuff here, Max understands everything. He says that the German soldier who is living here was 18 years old during World War II. And now, he must be about 64 years old. And as far as I think, he is not found anywhere else. He is still living here. Because all his stuff was lying in the same condition. That's when Remy got a big knife from a box. Suddenly, Sonia's other friend called him and started calling him to the other room. And whenever they go there, they go crazy. Because that whole room was covered in blood. There were piles of corpses there. Not only this, but there were also pieces of human flesh lying there. The rats were also eating that flesh. But seeing all this, their condition gets worse. They also think that who must be doing this? And what is going on here? She was thinking that suddenly the wolf's coming sound comes again. And these people start running. The wolf had seen them and he starts following them. These people run like hell and come to the other side of a door. Sonia's friend closes the door for them. The wolf grabs her leg from one place. He cuts her leg and separates it. After this, the three friends somehow save her. And now their eyes are on the wolf too, which was looking very scary. Then suddenly, a whistle comes and the wolf runs away from there. After that, these people bring that friend inside a room and put him to sleep. That poor man was in pain, with a lot of pain. He starts remembering his old time, 
Sonia and Remy were talking that we should leave our injured friend here. In this condition, how will we take him with us? That friend also had to listen to all their talks. He got very sad and starts crying. But she comes to him and tells him that don't worry. We will definitely come to take you. Saying this, she says goodbye to him and leaves from here. After his departure, it was dark in this room. Then his friend turns on the night mode of his camera. In which we can also see in the dark. As soon as the camera is on, we see a boat there. Who was wearing the uniform of the German army. That means he was a ghost of a soldier. And he attacks on his friend and kills him. When those three were leaving, the ghost of the German soldier comes in front of them. They had seen his face and they start running away in fear. But now the German ghost also starts following them. But suddenly they don't pay attention and Remy's feet hit that trap. In which he got stuck and got blasted. That means he explodes and he dies completely. Sonia and Max, who were left alive, are very scared that only two of us are left out of four. These people now go to the hole from where they came from. Seeing this, they are very scared that that place has been closed. They throw a bomb and try to open that hole, but their bomb does not blast at that place. And suddenly, the ghost of the soldier also came to them. Seeing him, Max started fighting him. He tries to kill him, but the ghost kills Max. Then the bomb exploded and the hole opened. Then Sonia goes inside it and goes to the other side. Sonia comes there and sees a lot of corpses. She was scared before too, but now her condition is getting worse. But as soon as they take care of themselves, she moves forward and the ghost also starts following her. Then those gang people catch Sonia, who had already caught her. But then the ghost also comes here. Seeing him, the gangsters leave Sonia and she runs away from here. Then the ghost started coming in front of them. Seeing him, they think that maybe he is an officer. So they salute him. But then the ghost comes to them and kills them all in one blow. Sonia runs away and reaches the place where the iron handles were installed to climb up. Sonia now started climbing up without a time witness. But then the ghost also came. He holds her leg and pulls her down. After which he starts strangling her. But Sonia attacks the ghost with the help of the handle lying down. Causing her to fall down injured. As soon as she releases Sonia. She beats her with her legs and weakens her. After which she starts climbing up with the help of those handles. As soon as she comes up. She sees that this is the exit. But unfortunately. That place is closed due to the greens of the ghost. Coming right up. Sonia calls for help. But unfortunately. No one can hear her voice. Here. Her fate is also not with her. Because then the ghost of the soldier pulls her down holding her leg. And he also kills her. And we can only hear her screams. So now, we are told that what did those three friends know? That after going there, we will never come back. We will die. Now, they had to enjoy. So they went somewhere else. They didn't know anything about this place. And she came here to explore. Which was their biggest mistake. And became the reason for their death. So until you don't know anything about such a thing, don't do it. Now, let's talk about that soldier king. He must have been stuck there in the second day. And he didn't find a way out. So he died here. And then he became a ghost. Who attacks the people who come here. And eats them to satiate his hunger. And with this terrible ending. This movie ends here.